Good evening, everyone. We learned more today about the deaths of a man and woman and two dogs found dead in a Detroit Lakes home on Tuesday. The Becker County Sheriff today identified the victims as husband and wife Stephen and Stacy Stearns. They say the medical examiner has ruled 49 year old Stacy's death a homicide and 45 year old Stephen's death a suicide. Law enforcement found their bodies yesterday morning after being called to their home on the west side of Big Detroit Lake just after 9 a.m. Tonight, family, friends, and people want to know that there is a lot more to this love story. WDA1 News reporter Matt Henson joins us live tonight with the couple's deep secret. Matt. Dan and Kirsten, Steve and Stacy Stearns had just celebrated their 21st wedding anniversary last week. Tonight, family and friends are grieving their loss. Normally, the campground at the Shell Lake Resort in Becker County is quiet this time of year as lake season comes to an end. On this day, it was quiet for another reason. They brought the life to everything. 45-year-old Steve Stearns and his 49-year-old wife Stacy won't be returning to their castle next year. They're big and lovable, and when they hug you, you felt like you felt warm and secure. That love defined by their marriage. Love for each other that made other couples jealous. Said it all the time. Always giving each other a kiss or a, a pat on the rear. The couple was unable to have children. Instead, they had two four-legged fur babies. There was Baby and there was Goliath, who weighed in at 150 pounds. And we had a birthday party for him and he had his own porterhouse steak. While the couple had done a lot of celebrating recently, the couple was silently grieving. He made me promise not to say anything. Somebody has to be able to tell people why we are going to do what we're going to do. Steve had recently been diagnosed with lung cancer that was too far along to treat. Stacy was battling stomach cancer. They said what kind of life would it be in and out of the hospital with chemo. Tammy says she was one of the two friends who Steve confided in with a dark secret. One, the couple's family did not know. They've always had a pact that we will go together. Tammy says Steve told her there was no time frame. And on Saturday, they talked about him living until his birthday next month. But his health rapidly declined in the next 48 hours. And all of a sudden, Goliath, who had his own health issues, could no longer walk. As it wasn't supposed to be yesterday. I knew it was coming. There was no set date. Tuesday morning, the couple posted this to their shared Facebook page. To our loved ones, we chose to leave this world as we lived in it, in love and together. Our only regret is the sorrow to our loved ones. Remember the laughter and happiness. We love you. Goodbye. The post also included a short will. Tammy says it was posted one minute before the couple called 911. He's not a murderer. This was done out of love. It's what they both wanted. They wanted to go together with their dogs. Family and friends of Steve and Stacy Stearns are asking people not to remember the way they died, but to live and love life like they did. Steve's words, we've had a good life, we've had a good run, and they were in love, and they'll love each other through eternity. The couple left their gazebo to the resort and clothes and dishes left behind at the resort will be donated to the Detroit Lakes Crisis Center. Funeral arrangements have not been finalized. Reporting live, Matt Henson, WDOI News.